Welcome back for the second half, match number 33. And uh, right now, the two teams are in the middle as SCAP Bandipur are taking on Sopor Football Academy. Both the teams are sitting at 1 1. If you look at Bali 2021, which is presented by New JK Roadways, and it has been organized by NIF, that's National and International Football Forum, in collaboration with JNK Sports Council. And it is sponsored by Kyber Milk, Purity of Kashmir. So, second half is just going to kick off. Yeah, this is the formation of the player as you can watch on the screens of the both teams. SCFA Bondipura's midfielder will start on the proceedings for the second half. We are here from the goal box. Started by Mr. Javid Amabat, managing director of the Supreme Collections. has been committed. The foul kick here goes in favor of Soko. The central referee is Yasir Magre. And he has been assisted by two of the referees, John Mohammed and Nala Kandare. has been placed spot where the foul was committed. Some tips were given to the captain. Sobor has got the opportunity to hit the second one on the board to go for the brace. Here he goes with the kick. But that went over the crossbar. No damage done. SCFA Bandipura 1, so poor Football Academy 1. Match number 33, second half has just begun. NIF Youth Football League, in which 24 teams have participated. And the teams were from various academies, were from various districts of the Kashmir region. seeing the teams from this side. So far as the two teams, one is the private, that is a Marco Football Academy. The second one is that team right now. And it is in the penalty area. He has gone forward with the force, but that has been trapped by number six. Number six uh, could it control it uh, properly to cap it in, and uh, it is going to be a free. In fact, it is going to be a corner kick in favor of Sopor Football Academy. Number six is going towards Sopor is a 
Vanessa, their captain. Placing the ball on the arc. Here he goes with your right footer. It has been tackled beautifully by the defenders. Right now, ball is with the center forward who goes towards his another comrade. The striker, that's number seven. Number seven was blocked by number five. Number five, but that's a very nice, fantastic back in passing towards number 11 who couldn't guard it, but still he has tackled the danger from the other. Right now, ball is with number 11. And she goes out. This is the assistant referee today, Bilal Ahmed Pari, on the left side. Here he goes, he's number 11. Number 11 was uh, very fantastically, he just passes it. Number 2 got the ball, he's very swift. If he got any time, a chance, he will not spare any moment here. He goes forward, but it has been very, very nicely taken by the goalkeeper in the end. Good bit of a work, although it was not a pacey one. There was not too much of a power behind that kick, but still, it has been very nicely taken by the goalkeeper.
they go on it and straight away they have got the second one as well but it has been declared an offside but offside has been declared offside has been declared by the assistant referee so this goal will not be counted as soon as the whistle was blown has been scored they are rejoicing and why not fantastic and once again two is the number in the picture number two is in the picture he got his goal number two before that the goal was declared an offside look at the replays there and he didn't spare any time there at in that Earlier and sent it into the net, and this is the goal number second for the SCFA Bounty Board. And they are rejoicing. Look at that. This was the scene where from they took the charge. They went there from like an eagle out of their nests. Here he goes. It's number seven from Sopo. They are trying really hard. The Bounty Board got now the praise for themselves. So good now to show some resilience, to show some comeback. That is SCFA Bandipura, State Council Football Academy Bandipura. Too many players there, but number seven. Has got the position, but he kicks it outside. This is the coach of Sopo Football Academy outside that area, giving some hair dry treatment to his uh, comrades, to his outfielders. He's not happy with the kind of football they are playing. But they can come back. There is too much time left in this. This session, the second half, has just begun. Here comes the vessel. He goes with the kick. It is just fell in the penalty area. What have you done there? But fortunate enough is the team of Sopor Football Academy that just went with the bounce over the crossbar. Could have been a disaster. And that was a feeble attempt by the goalkeeper. But in the end, he was fortunate that it went over the crossbar with the bounce. And no damage, no hat trick from the CFA Bantipora, they have to wait for it, but they are playing a fantastic football. A lot of times the shots have been on an accurate phase. The position have been most of the position, all position have been in the aggressive. And that's what is required. The short accuracy too have been fantastic. Here goes number 11. He was blocked and he goes forward. He's the one of the Super Football Academy. Super Football Academy is one of the comrades. That's number seven going towards his. And the comrade, he sends the pass to, into the penalty area. Where from has been kept. Goalkeeper comes in charge and he just manages to collect it. And no damage. Very well done by the goalkeeper. Goalkeeper was at exact position. He was knowing that the ball will gonna come into that area. And he just uh, went there. Was 
down there. Now he is getting up. He's number eight. I see a big body put up. change number six will go out and number ten will mark his entry
number nine. That's the captain. The captain got the ball. He goes with his sweet right footer towards his number two. He trapped it very nicely. He's going forward. He is very quick and agile. Fit. How do you think he is having in his posture? And he has scored two of the goals if Bandipura managed to snatch a victory against this Topo football academy team. This bloke will certainly without any doubt be a today's man of the moment or man of the match you can say color code advertisements private limited is one of the sponsors of the new youth football league 2021-22 the new jk roadways is the presenters of this league organized by nif collaboration with jnk sports council Today it is a Friday, very important day in the Islamic calendar. Everyone loves to enter the mosque as soon as possible. To pray oh, before the Almighty Allah to vanish the sins of past. Here he goes with the kick. It has been taken very nicely. He's just that was a half reverse bicycle kick. We would say half bicycle kick, but it is going to be a free kick now in favor of SCFA Bandipora. He will be awarded to them by the assistant referee. It's called. Here he goes. Very nicely. It has been taken by the defender from. So for football academy ball is being taken by number 10, number 10 going forward but there is a center back, center back kicks it from there on into the middle. Therefore it has been taken forward very nicely by number 3, that is the underside. That is from the center back of the SCFA body pura. It's quickly going forward but it is going to be a throw into SCFA body pura. Here number 7 sent in the throw in towards his 11 but 11 could it control it out of the byline there give it a free oh dear it's going to be yet another corner kick and captain is there as every time Sahil Sahil is going to deliver that corner kick ball has been placed at the right spot in that arc and he kicks it that's a very flat kick will it gonna land into the area but well work done by the defenders they have tackled the danger. Could have been the third one for the SCFA Bandipura, but it has been taken beautifully by the defenders from Super Football Academy. Sopo need an equalizer if they want to come back in the match. There is a difference of a goal. Sopo needs to fill that. But in a quick time, and the time is ticking for Sopo Football Academy. If they want to come back, they need to come back with the bang and all guns blazing. And if you football league. 2021 match number 33 second off is going on here he comes the kick out she goes for a throw into Sopo there comes the bicycle kick very nicely attempted sent it into the center platform it has been taken by number eight going forward very nicely sent it to number two number two got the position of the ball he's going forward very nicely but he has been brought down will it gonna be the penalty there oh my goodness me This could be a disaster. This could be a disaster for Sopur Football Academy. Mandipura have got the penalty kick area in that area. That wasn't with Coyote at all. He just brought him down. Goalkeeper was there. He could have done well, but in the end, the kick has been penalty kick has been awarded. So SCFA Bandipur. They have got a time now. They are very much happy that we can have the third one on the board. I had to cup goal. Precious moment here for SCFA Bandipur. Grass. Smash.
the strong grass already but with that goal they will control the game I would say the 90% they will control it here goes number two number two is there in the picture is from SAB Bandipura very talented very swiftly he is going with the Bears Number 13 from Super Football Academy is there. Number 10 from Banjipura Football Academy is there. Sahib. Here comes the whistle has been blown and he sent it into the net. No, no such word. And worries are just uploading here for the Super Football Academy. And they are going and they are their way they are parting their ways and with that look at that this is the replay of that goal that penalty kick which was delivered by number two and look at that he is going got the simple way to send it on that left side of that man the goalkeeper and what a turnaround First, they were lagging behind with the goal, and then they came with the three of the goals, and they are playing a sensational football. Nice comeback by this team. They have managed to score three goals. Although the previous goal that was very easy chance, but before that they have done fantastically well. Yeah, whistle has been blown, and offside was declared. Sobor is just parting their ways from this game. Three goal, one in the kitty. Here comes the number three. Number three passes it to his under corner. That's on that left side. Now ball is sent towards the other side. Wide prompt has been taken by the Winger. Winger sends the pass to number 10. He has entered into the penalty area, but well work done by the defender. That's number 4 from Sopo Football Academy. He is uh, their captain as well. And he has done really well. There was no other option other than to go for that slide. And it gives a uh, throw into. SCP Bandipura. Bantipura is enjoying every moment of the game. But he is how besetting this uh, Sopo team. And it's a handball, I would say. Yes, he just touched the hand. Number 20. Fantastic display. Yeah, whistle has been blown. Number eight goes with his left footer. He goes forward, but it has been taken by the goalkeeper very easily. And he just now sent it forward very nicely. Wide from it has been taken by number five. Number five goes forward towards his number seven, who is not there. The ball been taken by number two. Number two is a very, very talented 
youngster. And he has scored two goals for his team and gives them the lead. From that lead, and, uh, he was brought down when he was attempting to have the third one. In fact, all the goals we scored but for SCAP Bondi Kora by number three. And he will certainly be the man of the match if they will manage to snatch the victory against this so called football academy team. Here goes number two. Number two was not in a position there and all being taken by the goalkeeper. Here he goes forward very nicely. Ball is with number three. Number three was blocked and ball being sent out. In fact, that is inside now. She goes out. Here comes the throwing from the captain towards his number seven. From SCF Ivani Bora, that is Mudasir Rasul. Mudasir goes forward very nicely. And she went out of the goal line. Number 10 is not happy with the passing, but in fact, that was not the passer's default. It is yours because you are not able to control it. Here he comes, the number 4. Number 4 goes forward very nicely. He is the defender of a Super Football Academy. Sobor hasn't come back since that first goal. Ball possession mostly has remaining with SCF Bondipura. Shot accuracy has been perfect and the shots on target too are very, very perfect. Here comes the throw in. It has been taken in fact by number 10 from the Sobor, bottom, uh, in fact from the Sobor Football Academy and number 13 trying to go towards but it is given going to be a corner kick in favor of SCF Ivanipura. Here comes number 8 this time. From SCF Ivanipura is Hanan. Assigned with the duty of to go for the corner kick. Here he comes and he kicks it. That was well taken but she went outside. And, uh, no damage done. Further damage I would say for Sopor. Bondipura 3, Sopor Football Academy 1. Here he comes with the kick. It just landed inside in that area of the center of the circle. Sopor is in desperate need of a goal here. But, uh, the defenders are blocking the way every now and then. Is there he is down? I see a big one. Dipora is the he so he does not feel it. Well. Feeling some pain. Now he got up. Here he goes. He's the right full back, but the Winger has taken the ball. Winger was trying to go forward. He was blocked in the, that area. Which you are right now watching. And she goes out here. Comes the throw in. Now it will go in for Sopor. As whistle was blown by the referee. It's the time of Azan. So we are taking a breather. We will be right back.
back after this on time. Time is ticking for Super Football Academy. They have only one on the board. Bandipura Football Academy or SCFD Bandipura having three of the goals on the board. Here he comes forward very nicely. This could be a chance. Will yes, they have scored the fourth one as well. Number 11. Didn't waste too much of time there and sent it into the back of the net for a goal number four to SCFA Bandipura. Sobor Football Academy now going behind, behind and behind. And they have parting their ways from this contest. Look at that. He passes it to his number 11 gently. And number 11 just beat one of the players there, the defender there at and here he sent it on that left side of the goalkeeper into the back of the net for a fourth one on the board what a display what a fantastic display shown by SCAP Bandipura and uh, in case uh, let's tell to our viewers that if they might have switched on their TV sets uh, lately right now SCAP Bandipura got the upper hand against Sopor Football Academy as they have scored four of the goals and one goal being scored as a solitary goal for Sopor Football Academy and what a fantastic display and, uh, and, uh, Sopor was the team the first team to score the goal here but then SCAP Bondipura, what a comeback it has been since they scored that equalizer. What a comeback that has been. Scintillating effort. Fantastic display. Yes, yeah, shown by the Super Football. In fact, the SCAP Bondipura Super Football Academy have been done and dusted. They are, after that, they got the equalizer. This SCAP Bondipura Super has not got any of the chance. The short accuracy hasn't been perfect. Even they haven't managed too much of times to enter into the territory of SCAP Bandipura. That marks the end of the match. What a fantastic victory. A victory which they will remember for ages. Here's the team of SCAP Bandipura. And what a scintillating effort. We are signing off from this match which is won by SCAP Bandipura. 4-1 was the margin and we are bidding a goodbye. And let's meet you downstairs for the presentation sermon. Welcome back to the post-match presentation ceremony and uh, today match number 33 was played between SCAP Bandipura uh, versus uh, Sopor Football Academy and which was won by SCAP Bandipura. The margin of a goals was 4-1. Four, Four of the goals were scored by SCAP Bandipura and one was scored by Sopor Football Academy. And the jury has decided that Akiv from SCAP Bandipura who have scored three of the goals for his team and he was declared man of the match and the man of the match award will be presented by Mr. Altaf Ahmad Anga, Guzar Ahmad Anga. Uh, from uh, the Department of Youth Services and Sports. is a physical master there and he will present the award to Akib Amin from SCAP Bandipura. And uh, he will also present the check to Akib Amin, a check of 1500 rupees from uh, the New Jake and Roadways. And uh, let's talk to Akib. Let's have a few words with us. Akib, what do you want to say today? Today, you have three goals for your team. So, it's very nice. Today, you have done the first goal. It was not the Super. But after that, you have done a lot of work. What do you want to say today? Allah, my name is Shaitan Rajji. In the name of Allah, Rahim. First of all, thank God for the match. The coach has told us that we have to take a look. 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 I have to take a look. I have to take a look. तो आप मुझे ये बताइए आपके बाप वहाँ पे जो बांडीपोरा से आप ताहुक रखते हैं कि आप वहाँ पे प्रैक्टिस कहाँ पे करते हैं? शेरी कश्म स्टेड ऑफ बांडीपोरा में जो हमारा कोच है यावर और इमरान इमरान हाशमी और वो तो बहुत ही अच्छे कोच हैं हमारी टीम के लिए और होना भी अच्छा है। आप रोज प्रैक्टिस करते हैं? हाँ, जी सर
तो यहाँ पर हमारे साथ जुड़े हैं कि गुजार साहब उनसे बात करेंगे इस बारे में कि जो यहाँ पर मैच हुआ था तैंतीसवा मैच आज खेला गया है निफ यूथ फुटबॉल लीग दो का तो गुलजार साहब से यही बात करेंगे गुलजार साहब आप हमें ये बताइए कि आज जो मैच खेला गया एस एफ बाडी पेरा तो कितना आप इसको आपने बिल्कुल करीब से देखा है तो क्या आपको लगा कि कितना टैलेंट है इस यूथ में कि जो एस सी एफ ए बाडी पेरा की ये पहली बार मैं देख रहा हूँ कि निफ ने जो इनिशिएटिव लिया यूथ लीग फुटबॉल टूर्नामेंट का ये बहुत ही अच्छा है मैंने इतना ऑब्जर्व किया कि बाहर जो लंगे साइड से हंदवा पहली बार हुआ है तो बिल्कुल इसको मतलब अब सराहना उनकी करनी चाहिए नेचुरली हंड्रेड परसेंट ये जो मैं देख रहा था लंगेट हंदवारा से टीम आई थी इतने फोर फ्लॉग एरिया से इतनी टीमें आई बाहर हंदवारा बारामूला सोपोर ये बहुत ही अच्छा कदम है यूथ फुटबॉल के लिए हमारे पास बहुत टैलेंट है लेकिन इसको उबारने के लिए कोई प्लेटफॉर्म चाहिए जैसे कि निफ ने अवेलेबल किया इन छोटे बच्चों को आई हैव सीन द सो मेनी प्लेयर्स आर वेरी नाइस प्ले आज के मैच के बारे में ये बताऊंगा कि बहुत ही अच्छा मैच और दोनों साइड से बहुत ही अच्छी टीमें थी अब तो आपको पता है ये फुटबॉल में जिसका लोहा मनवाया गया इन्होंने तीन गोल किए जिस बच्चे ने हैट्रिक किया है ये टूर्नामेंट की पहली हैट्रिक है बेस्ट लक फॉर हिम और इन ये यूथ आगे ये मतलब निफ आगे भी ये काम करता रहेगा ये एक ऐसा प्लेटफॉर्म देते रहेंगे वो गर्ल्स के लिए भी क्योंकि हमारे पास गर्ल्स का स्टेप बहुत कम आ रहा है क्योंकि हमारी सर कमस इस वक्त यूटी में अच्छी चल नहीं चल रही है इसलिए तो हम कोशिश करेंगे इन निफ से हम जुड़े हुए हैं इन इनको आगे भी ले जाएंगे इन हम अच्छा प्लेटफॉर्म प्रोवाइड तो आपसे मेरा और एक सवाल रहेगा कि आपके मतलब आप तो बिल्कुल लाइक फिजिकल एजुकेशन मास्टर है डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ यूथ सर्विस एंड सपोर्ट्स में तो आपने बिल्कुल करीब से देखा होगा आपकी एज भी माशाला पचास के करीब करीब होगी तो आपने बिल्कुल ये भी देखा होगा कि कितने प्लेयर्स आपकी नजर में जो थे आज वो एक स्टार बन के उभरे हैं तो कितने को आपने देखा होगा आज अगर आप देखेंगे यहाँ पर सारा जो इस वक्त इस प्रेजेंटली इस इस टाइम चल रहा है फुटबॉल ये सारे प्लेटफॉर्म डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ यूथ सर्विस इनको दिया आप देखो कितने इंटरनेशनल मेराज वडू इशफाक साजिद डॉट जो इंडिया कोच रहे माशाल्लाह अल्लाह सलामत रखे सबको तो ये सारे इन्होंने मेहनत करके इनने खुद हमने एस पी स्कूल से मैंने कम से कम पाँच छः लड़के इंटरनेशनल प्रोड्यूस किए थे उस वक्त अभी तक वो चल रहे हैं जैसे कि बैंक में इस वक्त खेल रहे बच्चे वो भी वहाँ स्कूल लेवल से आ गए ऊपर स्कूल लेवल उनको अच्छा एक प्लेटफॉर्म बिगनिंग में दे रहा है कि इंटरनेशनल खेलने के लिए तो माशाला इन शह इस साल भी कोशिश करेंगे कि इनके अब जो ये अब स्टार्स जो हमारे हैं ये बहुत मेहनत कर रहे हैं आउटसाइड स्टेट इन साइड स्टेट मैं बहुत बहुत ही शुक्र गुजार हूँ कि उन्होंने फुटबॉल को बहुत कुछ दिया है अल्लाह इनको सलामत रखे थैंक बिल्कुल सर आप ऐसे ही काम करते रहे तो यहाँ पर हमारे साथ जुड़े थे गुलजार अहमद साहब जो कि डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ यूथ सर्विस एंड स्पोर्ट्स में इस वक्त अपने फरज अंजाम दे रहे हैं इसके साथ हमारे साथ जुड़े थे आकिब अमीन जो आज के मैच मैच थे तो दैट्स ऑल वी हैव फ्रॉम द प्रेजेंटेशन सेमनी डाउन हेयर